we are at a clarifying moment in which the wolf is at the door. Anybody who was complacent about women's reproductive freedom, they have to understand what a point of crisis we're at. So I've been partnering with Guttmacher for more than 20 years, and I have to say, this is the greatest hostility I've witnessed toward reproductive health care decisions. We'll work with the Congress to end taxpayer funding of abortion and abortion providers. There's never been a more important time to have institutions who have the very best science, the very best facts, and the very best reputation. And that's what Guttmacher does. The biggest challenge that women are facing right now is access to affordable contraception and safe abortion worldwide. There's huge unmet need. There is no woman or girl on the face of the earth who does not have full, equal rights inherently. But we're not there yet. So we would like to see that translated into reality. What I hope for in the next 50 years is that all people in this country and around the world are free to control their bodies and control their future. In the years ahead, what we want is to empower people to be able to control their own reproductive lives. The ultimate goal is for every person to have access to the health care that they need and the ability to chart their lives as they see fit, regardless of their gender, their sexual orientation, their class, their race. We have to continue to persuade. We have to continue to propose that, yes, we expect nothing less than full equality for every 10-year-old girl across the entire planet. In order for that to be possible, we have to act in good faith and we have to have good information. And I think Guttmacher really has nailed the good information piece of that. The struggle will continue and there'll be a lot of battles ahead. Guttmacher and others will continue to cooperate to marshal the evidence to resist assaults on reproductive healthcare decision making and to push back and expand access every way we can. If Guttmacher didn't exist, we'd have to create it. So thank goodness it does.